Hello, this is Sunny. Welcome back. Today, my topic is hash algorithm and how to hack your passwords. There's many hash algorithms such as MD4, MD5, SHA1, SHA256, RIPMD, Tiger, Whirlpool, and just to name a few. There are many hash generator websites. Let me choose chooseforNoops.com to calculate a digest using different hash algorithms. And you can see uh, there's a long list of hash algorithms. Some look familiar like MD4, MD5, SHA1, and some don't. But don't worry. Uh, let me use several different algorithms to calculate my password ABC123. Okay. First, let me uh, choose MD4. Uh, you can see the output digest is 128 bit long. Uh, MD5 uh, digest size is the same. Next, I want to try SHA1. And you see the digest is a little bit longer, is 160 bit long. Um, next is SHA256. Um, you see the resulting digest is much longer. I guess what's the size? 256. And RIPE MD, that's another uh, hash algorithm family. The version 128 output size is 128 bit long. And last, let me let me try Whirlpool, Whirlpool, and the Whirlpool, the hash output size is much longer, is uh, 500 bit long. The following table is the summary of a digest of my password ABC using six different hash algorithms MD4 and 5 and SHA1 or any lower version of hash algorithms are not considered secure uh, anymore uh, the pattern is within each hash algorithm family the higher the version the longer the digest the better hash algorithm Next, I will use website crackstation.net to decode a digest. And crackstation uses massive lookup tables to decode a password digest. For MD5 and SHA1, they have 190 gigabyte 15 billion entry lookup table and for other hash algorithms they have a 19 gigabyte, 1.5 billion entry lookup table. Let me demonstrate how to hack some passwords. I will still use tools for noobs to generate a digest, and then use crackstation to decode it. Let's start. I will test several most commonly used passwords. Number one is one two three four five six. I choose MD5 hash it I get the digest. I copy and paste digest to crackstation.net boom we decode the digest. You see the type is MD5 password is one two three four five six. Let me try rock you. And this time I will choose SHA one. I do the same things. I copy and paste the digest to crack station. In no time I get the result I want. You can see how easy to decode a password digest. 
How about a password? I love you, princess. I still choose Sha Wan. Here you are. Here is the digest. I copy and paste it to crackstation.net. Click crack hashes. Here you are. I love you, princess. Let me choose. Let me try the last one. Uh, password one two three four five. Let me choose this time SHA-256. It's longer. I repeat the same step. I will copy and paste the digest to crackstation.net. Click the button. Yes, I get the password 12345. Now you can say I can hack many simple passwords by using some websites. And you may ask, is this how professional hackers or cyber criminals do? Probably not. But the principle is the same. They use pre-generated candidate digest database to compare with the stolen password digest database. Once some entries match, they found passwords. The only difference is they use more sophisticated ways and methods. What are they is another story in another video. Thank you very much and see you next time.